Here are just a few men's fashions that were ended by the war to end all wars. Frock coats were still relatively common prior to World War I, especially amongst certain professions and as formal attire, but they almost entirely disappeared after it, replaced by morning or evening tailcoats for formal occasions and day suits for business wear. Meanwhile, while top hats were still worn with formal attire, they essentially vanished as conventional day wear. Wing collars suffered a similar fate and were relegated almost exclusively to formal evening attire outside of certain professional occupations, like notaries and bankers who kept the trend alive a little longer. Day suits, which before the war could feature cutaway fronts, evolved closed fronts, and essentially developed into modern day suits. Because of concerns that a gas mask could not fit securely over facial hair, many men stopped wearing full beards. The United States military even mandated that all servicemen be clean-shaven. Returning home, they turned in their guns but held on to their razors, and it took almost a century for full beards to come back into style. Want to learn more about the incredible history of menswear? Subscribe to the Gentleman's Gazette channel.